Lane. The Robinson community still has more questions than answers tonight after an FBI standoff ended with one man killed and possibly explosive materials removed from a property. Channel 6's Andrew Moore followed up with local law enforcement, the FBI and neighbors today now that the scene is clear and joins us now with more. Andrew. Monty, the FBI finally reopened East Steagall Road last night after a three day investigation. And while an FBI agent assured me by phone there is currently no danger to that community, neighbors are still trying to make sense of what happened. It was a little unnerving, frankly. Four days ago, this house on East Steagall Road in Robinson was surrounded by the FBI. Neighbors say they heard grenades thrown and officials yelling for the suspect to come out. He was eventually shot, but neighbors still don't know why. It makes me concerned that there was somebody that had done something that garnered that kind of attention. The McLennan County Sheriff's Office told Channel 6 Sunday their bomb squad removed what appeared to be a hand grenade and explosive materials from the scene. Neighbors still want to know what the suspect was doing with those materials in the first place. It does make me concerned for um, the safety of my family and for the motive. The bomb squad would return to the scene the next two days until it cleared Saturday night. But while the FBI says the neighborhood is safe, locals still wonder what they were saved from. Was there a particular entity that was targeted? I mean, was this a hate crime in the making? I, I, it, just, it just boggles the mind. The FBI is still not ready to release the identity of the man shot, but after talking to an agent today, we are expecting an update sometime this week. Money? All right, thanks, Andrew.